Six, don't you leave me! Don't leave me! Hello, everybody, and welcome back to the fa- Come on, why are you moving by yourself? Scary. Uh, welcome to the- Oh, is that rain? Oh, guys, this is a bit scary. <laughs> There's lots of scary things going on. Welcome to the last episode of Little Nightmares. Yep, this is it. This is gonna be it. This is the one that we see Monster 6 close up. Oh, hold on. Oh, I need to get up here. The one where we, um, you know, I hopefully don't get dropped by 6 this time. Maybe. Maybe there'll be a little secret in it. Maybe because we're doing a first person, she won't drop us. Never know. <laughs> Because we've got more of like a personal connection. Oh, here I go. Whoops. Ooh. Okay, just kind of puts the camera. So we don't necessarily follow. <gasps> the black box returns. So we've got to do a little bit of the Pale City first. And then once we do the Pale City, we'll move on. I think that'll do. <laughs> I think that's good. To the signal tower. Whoop. <laughs> I don't know my own strength. I just destroy everything. Here I go. Ooh. I was like inside the TV there for a second. Oh, okay. <gasps> also, we get to see like that room. The ladies room too. Oh. Oh. Do I fall out here? Uh, I think that's a yes. Ooh, it's weird. <laughs> It's weird seeing this all in first person. Cause normally at this point, it's uh it's I'm just like looking at everything on the left, but actually I can see it's mostly stuff to the right that I'm able to see. And there's nothing there. Brilliant. But uh, uh, there we go. Right, now I've been told that apparently when we're being chased by the eye creature, that we um we can't do that bit in first person now i don't know if that's like do the controls break oh look mm. this is where we get the controller this is down okay so this still counts as like it doesn't matter which way i'd look and um, just hold down okay gotcha we can jump off okay let's have a look at this guy so sat there watching tv tv decided to eat him we got an on and an off button. Blech. Oh, ho, ho. Look at his cheese. He's had cheese and that's it, apparently. Here we go. Whoop. Ooh. I like being inside it. Oh, yes. This is the post office. Oh, yes. Now, do we... Yeah, we just want to run across, don't we? Because we need to get to the other side. And jump off there. It has been a crazy day for me, guys. You have no idea. <laughs> I was going to have a lie in. And then I ended up having to drop Whitney off somewhere. And then I also realized I had my car in for an MOT. And I was like, oh, God, that's lucky. <laughs> and I kind of had to just sort of wait and be like, okay, well, I've got to pick Whitney up again. <laughs> Do I have time to record this? Uh, no, I didn't really. But, uh, oh, wait, I have to do this way. Oh, okay. Okay, okay. I think that's... Is that good? Ah, that's good enough. Through the TVs. Oh, look, there's secret letters in the TV. Ooh. Oh, I want to have a look at all of the, um, all of the secret little, uh, images that show up on the TV. If you like, because when Mono goes through it, there's loads of, like, this, I think the Thin Man appears on the TV. There's some other things as well. I'm sure some of them have got to be, like, a, um... Uh, there's, there's like a, a secret hidden message in there somewhere. There always is. And I, I, while I was loading this in. Oh, that's it. That's the ladies room thing. Oh, okay. Here we go. Um, there's also a, uh, yeah, when I was loading it, sorry. I realized that Tarsis Studios came up. I was like, oh, I read that and thought this is going to be the last time we see Tarsis Studios <laughs> in a little nightmares game. But hopefully that doesn't mean that it's going to be bad. Like the next Little Nightmares. So here it is. This. Oh. <gasps> Ooh. What is this nonsense? Ah, that's the room from the next over that they haven't rendered. But this. This is really interesting. We have slippers. And it's, it's just like a single room. Like there's nothing else here. There can't be anything else here. Because that would be... That would lead into the hallway. We have a portrait of the lady. We have... The collectibles 
from the lady, as well as lots of post. And then, I don't know what this is, a newspaper. You take it. My precious. We also have a fridge and then a sink. I don't know. Oh my, okay. Okay, for a start, we've got pictures of the guest. We've got what it seems to be a picture of the moor. I can't really make that out, but that's that looks like a moor shape. And I don't know what that other one is. Guys, let me know in the comments, that bottom one. But that looks like a picture of the guests and the moor. So, this could, like, this is the thing, man. Ah, die! Unladylike. <laughs> it's like, did the developers put that in specifically to tell a story that that whoever lived there had something to do with the moor? And see, that's the door there. That's how you get into that room. Um, or is it by chance, you know, just someone who they just, they just wanted to put it in there for an Easter egg? Because it is technically just an Easter egg room. I love it. It's just like listening to death metal. Now, also... Are these people going through various stages of being sucked up by the TVs? So, for instance, this woman here... There's the red, okay. Go. 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 There we go, sliding in. Sliding- Oh, look! Oh, that's interesting! There's two of them! Because <laughs> we, we've seen that some people... Yeah, I can't, I can't even see that there's loads of images there. We've seen that some people seem to get eaten by, um buy the TVs and they, they, their clothes are just left. Hello! Hello, precious! <laughs> Looks a bit uh, PG-13, uh, eh? <laughs> we'll just, we'll ignore it. Uh, also, we get to see what happens to this guy when he falls. Because sometimes they're eaten completely by the TV. Sometimes they've just got their faces and eyes consumed. Hmm. The signal tower definitely isn't just a signal tower. It's more than that. It's more than just a building. It's a disguise. Nothing's ever as it seems. There's always masks and stuff in this game. Nope. Yep, there we go. Okay, let's see what this guy does. Oh, what? Oh, I forgot. <laughs> that is terrifying, though. I forgot to turn the TV on the other way. <laughs> Wait a minute. How did he kill me? Isn't that one of the cancelled songs? Whoa. That now, if people don't know, some people might know this, others might not, but that whistle, I don't know whether that's actually part of, like, there's this one hidden song in the TVs, and it seems to be like, or what people have speculated to be a good ending, which I highly doubt. No, oh, he vanishes, damn it. <laughs> My TV, mine, mine. Oh, it's just blank in here lied to. Oh, look, she's still there. I was gonna say, please don't fall. Come on, climb up. The, so, there's also a lot of, like, I don't know whether it's just because I'm picking up on it because I, I notice it because I'm sort of studying it, but you've got with the, the food and with a lot of the lettering, there's a lot of Japanese in it. And if you listen to one of the broadcasts, not that you can ever really figure out what anything is saying, but it sounds like some of the broadcast is Japanese muffled as well. Now, I really don't think that the creators meant for it be- Oh yeah, it's Japan. Like, there's a, like the lady is definitely- There's a lot of, there's a lot of like, um, Japanese, uh, what'd you call it? There's a lot of Japanese influences. Oh, look at them. Where do they go? What do they do? They just, they're just falling off. And then decides he's just gonna go. The signal towers are just telling them to do this. But how did they get here is the question. Oh, man. Do they all do it if we just stay here? Yeah, they all they all just go. I don't think I've ever just stayed there. But yeah, with the more, there's a lot of um, Asian influences with the architecture and stuff. Especially with the lady herself, who is basically like a, a geisha. Um, ooh, a red dot. That's interesting. Uh, and with the lettering as well, there's, there's, there seems to be a lot more coincident. Ooh, hold on. <gasps> the back of the TVs has the eyes on them as well. So, I mean, if we, you know, we didn't know already, they're definitely linked. The TVs are linked to the eye monster, which, I mean, I think we could have hazard a guess already. What's that image? Or something in the woods. Okay. Okay. Oh, freak you. Uh, oh, yeah, go in here. Hello. 
Whoa! <laughs> Bye! <laughs> then the camera follows us. All right, all right. Do you want to know the tactic with this one? You want to make sure you do it flawlessly. You want to pull off the first one. I see, I see. It's like a bloody zombie or something. This one, you just want to like do it in increments. There you go. And there, there, we're done. We're sorted. We're good. Aha! Look at him! Nowhere near us! Beautiful! Ha <laughs> ha! Gotcha! I like you're still sparking and you can run past him though. <gasps> this is it! This is how we get the achievement! Guys, here we go. Okay, so we need to change our hat to the postman hat. Okay. And off we go. Do I have the gnome hat? Because I thought I... Yeah, I do have the gnome hat. Awesome! I just don't have the, um... The what do you call it? The uh, the one that is like pre-orders only or something <laughs> like special edition hat. <laughs> I wonder if that's an achievement. Here we go! Woo! Okay, so what is down here? We got like scrunch up bits of paper, TVs, a uh, a doll. What is that? This suitcase right here. There is a little parcel. Now, what could we be delivering? So the thing is, even though it seems like this place is, you know, not functioning at all, the post is still being delivered. I think that tells something about this world. Are you ready, guys? Are you ready? We're going to take it. Oh, you can see something. You can see. Hello. Oh. Look at those long hands. And he just takes it. Post industrial. <laughs> That's the we just got. And there's that song on the TV. I don't think I've ever heard this song played on the TVs. This is the song that only played on the more TVs. Why is it playing now? Or have I just never heard it? There, that's that's normal. That's that's like a normal TV sound. So the longer I've played, or like when we're playing Little Nightmares 1, it appears that the TVs have no broadcast. Like the, the stuff they're broadcasting now just doesn't exist. Um, but once the, the you know little nightmares takes place and we find out it's not as it's a prequel, um, it seems like by the time six completes the moor or kills the lady, that is when um, the the signal man comes or becomes active and he like you know mono turns into the thin man. Sorry, not man. Okay, here we go. So it doesn't. So what we need to do here is quickly just jump on, jump off. Here we go. Go in. Quickly, quickly, quickly. Quickly, quickly, catch a monkey. Oh. Oh. Whee, there we go. Yeah. Oh, look at the little bunny bun. Oh, he's so cute. And then here's where we c commit a crime again and a murder. Lovely creepy doll. Creepy doll is creepy. Creepy doll is falling up. No, don't pick up that doll. Anything here? Nope. Nope, nothing here. Okay. Again, there looks like... You know, there's kids' toys, right? But there's there's no sign of a kid. At all. Okay, so this is going to be interesting. Oh, see, I don't know how the freaking... What do you call it? The, there's a radio in here. Why? Okay. Uh, I don't know how the other guy didn't have a problem with this TV in the bath. This guy does. Go, go, go. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Yes! Die! Again, we've got a bunch of random pictures of just people, viewers, I think they're called. Yeah, just... Who's taking these pictures? They're not even photos. They're more like drawings. Anyway, I'll take the little stool. Thank you very much. Oh, that's right. This takes us to uh, ooh, the climactic... Or, sorry, not the... Ooh, oh. Wait, did I die? I died! <laughs> okay, well, never mind. Who was I supposed to fall on? Oh, was I supposed to fall on something else? Or did I not land on the garbage? Hello? Hello, people. Can I come through? I think I just die, don't I? Or am I not allowed? No, I'm not allowed. Damn it. Oh, but I can see. I think, actually, if you no-clip the camera and you go over there, it does show something. And it's not the TV. Well, the TV's broadcasting, but it's broadcasting um, the inside of the signal tower in that one, which is weird. I mean, you're not supposed to see it, right? And I always think when you go out of bounds and do stuff like this that 
you know, you're not supposed to see this stuff. And this is the interesting thing. This doll right here that's obviously now the viewers is here. Um, and it was actually in the first Little Nightmares game. Why, like, some toy manufacturer manufacturer would be making those dolls? It's hot. It's oh, weird. So this is known as the shop. Um, on Misewa. But I really don't think it is a shop, if I've got to be honest. Oh god, don't run me over. Go on then. Off you go. Push. Woo. Uh, so I've seen people that actually they put the trolley in between the TV. Um, but for whatever reason, I always thought like, like oh, I don't know, you jump on there, jump on there, then jump. But I'll, you know what? I'll do it this time. I'll just try and put it there. And it looks like that's where you're supposed to put it because there's a drain. I'm an idiot. <laughs> Ah, oh, because the drains sort of hold the trolleys in specific areas. Another ball. Is there anything? Can we throw it against anything? I don't think we can. Slippers underneath the bed. This could be the... Uh, th this, to me, doesn't seem like a shop. Oh, God, the teddy bear's alive! It, it's a toy maker, right? Like, there's toys everywhere. I guess it is kind of a shop. It's a toy shop. But this is where he makes the toys. Or where he used to make the toys. Again, lots of signs of... Uh, uh, Wait, can I not grab it? Grab it. Yeah, there we go. Lots of signs that there is, it's, or was at some point, loads of children. Because why would adults need the toys? But there are no children. Hold on. Hold on. There's a dude there. I've never seen him before. <gasps> That's him. And it looks like he died holding one of his toys. Ooh. Was that the original toy maker? The toy maker. What's that from? I feel like that's from something. I am the toy maker. Is that like Spy Kids? I feel like that's freaking Spy Kids, isn't it? Oh, Jesus. That's a blast from the past, isn't it? Oh, man. Let's bring the shopping trolley to where it's su supposed to go. Because apparently it's not supposed to go here. There's the drain. There's the drain. I bet it just sits perfectly, doesn't it? Freaking well does. I mean, I've been an idiot. <laughs> no, never mind, lie to. I'm just stupid. Oh, apparently as well, running away from the, uh, the magic man, <laughs> the thin man, uh, doesn't work with this as well when you get on the trains and stuff. I'm sure that's to do with, um, you know, it's, it's a fan-made mod, this, and the way the camera controls must work. Yeah, you can do it. Okay. Woohoo! And out we go to God knows where. Oh, it's a little room, isn't it? That's right. Climb on it. Hey! There we go, there we go. Ooh. This is the one. Hup. I need to fall. How do I do this? Yeah, because those are the viewers there. Do I just fall down? Oh, yeah, I just fall down. <laughs> All right. Oh, look how terrifying this is. Look at this. They knew what they were doing. Bandai were like, yeah, you know Resident Evil? That's a cool game. Hey, look, a hat. Oh, and a hand. Is it an actual hand? Yeah, that's a, that's a hand, man. That's a hand. That's a hand. Hello. And again, look up here. What could be like Japanese lettering? 100%. 100%. It's even writ out like you would. Like a calligraphy or whatever it is, I think. There we go, there we go, there we go. Crouch! Crouch! Hide! Go on, off you go. Yes. Go look at the TV. Very brilliant. Oh, this is going to be terrifying now. Because as soon as I start going through this one, they start breaking out. Yeah, they're coming. They're coming. Hello. Hey, guys. Freaking run. Just got to run. Just got to run. Oh, God. I forget it all the time. Oh, let's go. Stop. I know they're close. Oh my god, he's so close. He just broke down the door. He just broke down the door. Oh my god. Up! Oh! Oh! Run! 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 I don't know how close they are. I don't know how close. I don't know how close. Ah! Oh! 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 I live! Oh! It's terrifying. Off we go. This is it. Yep. You always know when you hear that. And look, he, there's got to be a symbolism here. 
That is another door that's shaped exactly, and with a hatchet, exactly like the one I break through when it comes to six. Six! No! I don't want to save you! Oh, look! That room looks like it's glitched. Yeah, because we're not supposed to see that room, so it's got the, um, the thingy effect on it. Do we do it? I'm coming! Hey, babes! How you doing? I'm gonna... Oh, God! Oh, Jesus! I thought that was again! No! Oh, God, he's gonna come. Run, run, run. Oh, oh thank you, Mr. Axe. Thank you. Oh, he's terrifying. There you go. Just peg it. Peg it. Peg it. Go, 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 go. Here we go. And he's lost us. We get in here. We're safe. We're safe. You can't, you can't teleport in here. <laughs> Even his footsteps are like freaking, like ticking hands on a clock. Hey, buddy, how you doing? You can't see me. It's fine. You wait for it. There he goes. Yeah, he does just vanish. I could have walked in there. I'd love to see him interact with a viewer. He's going to open it. No! Stop! Stop! Oh, there's a train. Come on. Is he, is he coming? I mean, I think he is. There we go. Ah! Oh! He almost got me. He almost got me. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Up at the train. I don't know how Mono survives. Right, okay. So this is where it apparently glitches. And the, oh, yeah. Oh, God. Yeah, the camera. Oh, jeez. It, it kind of like... It's like inverted. It's like inverted controls. I'm clicking right here. It's like I'm, I'm, I'm playing the game. Oh, God. Run. Yeah, hold on. Let's just see if we can do this like first person. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. This is really odd. He's got me, hasn't he? Yeah, he's got me. Yeah. <laughs> that is... Oh, yeah, I can see how, like, you can't... Yeah, you can't work with that, man. Oh, wait, no. Oh, come on, that's cheating. <laughs> I was adjusting the camera. Yeah, so those controls, obviously, the uh, Nico who's made this mod hasn't worked out this bit of the camera. Because obviously the controls completely change because it's... The camera the controls must be different. Uh! Go, go, go! You wouldn't hurt little postman! Wait, I'm still a postman! You wouldn't hurt a little British boy! <laughs> doesn't even sound British. There we go. Oh, we are! See you later! You may look at me. No, you'll never get past you! Ha ha ha! Just watches me. Oh, oh, that is freaky. Oh no. Oh, oh, and then I'm dead. Yep, there. Bye. <laughs> He's still there. You can sort of teleport, right? Not that far away when you think about it. <gasps> and this is it. Ah, my back. I fell on the remote. <laughs> Ooh. I'm assuming it's sparking. Yeah, there it is. It's dead, destroyed. Not gonna find another one of those anytime soon. He's still there, just looking. So like, wait a minute. Does he realize what's happening? All right, so we're going to see shadow sex. <gasps> Leading me. He's still there. He's still waiting on the train. A part of her's missing. The part of her that makes her hungry. She needs to fill it in. You want to call it a soul? I guess you could. Oh, wow. Oh, it looks like an eye. 
It's all about eyes. All seeing, all knowing. Oh, is that more pants and stuff? I think it is. Come on, six. We can do this. We can do this. She's like, up there. Up I go. Oh, wow. Oh, they'll be weird to see this in first person. Oh, I got into here. No. Your headphones back on. We're good. We're good. We're good. There we go. There it is, the signal tower. Now this is of quite significance because this is where Mono puts down his hat or whatever it is. It's probably my little cap in this case. Because the whole time that like Mono has been hiding he's from something, probably from this thing, he's been hiding. And there it is. There it is the thin man. Oh look, the signal tower is gone. The light of the signal tower is left because he's not there anymore. Oh, and there it is. It's back on again. Have I dropped my hat? Where's my hat? I'll put it down. I'm about... Oh. oh, there we go. There we go. I got you, buddy. Woo! The light's still there. Ooh. He's starting to, like, splinter now. No! Don't you do it! Look at him, all twisted. You're gonna die, me! Future me! I like how I'm making a what there's all like a white glow coming from him, and I'm making a black glow. Which is the same kind of glow that Six makes when the ladies, uh, just before the lady, uh, dies. Or when, sorry, Six gets back to the power of the lady. So. There it is! You did it, buddy! Is there still time to break this cycle? Like, could Mono do anything here? There he goes. Okay. Oh, we're standing up. Here we go. This is going to be weird in first person. So, I, I literally think we do bring the tower to us. Like, I thought maybe we just, like, teleported a bit like the, the Thin Man does, but... <laughs> the more I look at it, the more I think, no, actually, we do bring it. Look at it! It comes to us. Because the drain's still behind us. Yeah, the drain's still there. And it welcomes us with open doors. <sighs> Should we do it? Should we go in? Yeah, nah, I'm good. I'm good, fam. Let's go home. <laughs> Let's go. In we go. No. This is it. This is it. It's coming to an end, guys. Whoa. It's like so we can see through a wall. Is what about below? Ooh, look at our little toesies. They're all blue and glowy. It opens the door for us. I forgot about that. Oh, that's weird. Okay. So now that we're in here, time can change. Time's no longer a thing. Is it the eye that's wanting to find six? I don't think we just pushed on this door. Could we actually get, like, is it a shortcut? <laughs> just straight away get to six. Okay. Okay. Whoop! Oh, this is gonna be trippy. Okay, so we some of the doors have eyes on them. Is it possible to get to that door? I still want to jump over to it! Because maybe if we could get in that crack. <gasps> we might be able to get over to it! We might be able to get over to it! Whoa! Oh, that's weird! This whole- that was so trippy. I don't think this game's, like, programmed to have you die here. Oh, okay, never mind. <laughs> it was lit okay, you can't get out unless you jump. Okay, okay, I- I- but yeah, we'll not do that anymore. <laughs> now, this is weird when there's no sound. 
Nothing. No doors open, except for that one. There's no, like, because the game thinks I'm up there, which I'm not, so the sound's not playing. But if I can get over to here. Oh! I think you can do it. I think you can do it. I think we got, we got to try it. We, we got to try this. Oh, damn it. <laughs> okay, okay, we'll just continue on. It was worth a shot. It was worth a shot. The interesting thing is it's definitely a tower. Like when you look at this, it's it's like 100% a tower right there. There's an eye again on top. But when Mono is in there, it's not a tower. It's just a room. But when Six is in it, it's definitely a tower. Gotta go back through. Ooh, is that eye always there? That's freaky. Because the eyes are the walls. So it makes sense. Where am I? Okay. And then this is... Yeah, to... Oh, wow. Yeah, look. It was... Oh, interesting. Ooh. <laughs> Legit took us, took us to the that door that we were going to go to next. Look at... Whoa. Look at all that. And the different stairs. But we, we only ever go like left, right, left, right. But look at that one where you could... Multiple choice. There I am. Do I go through this one? Yeah, I do. Okay. Yeah. And then we have to push open this one in order to... There it is. And then in order to... Oh, oh, oh wow. That's weird. Yeah, this is it. Okay. And then we're above now. Yeah, we're right above that. That's the last one up there. That's the last one. It's so cool. I love this. I love the creepy aesthetic and everything of this. Ooh, interesting. Portraits. What are the portraits? A portrait of her. Monster Six. So these portraits are of significance to Six. They must be. Oh, there's another portrait here too. That's the viewer in it. This one's the viewer. Here it is, this one. And we're done. Yeah, this is it. This is it, the final one. No more tower. Ooh. <laughs> what if there's like a secret room you could go to, right? And just no one's discovered it. I would love if, if like there was something like that. And it was until like five or ten years later, somebody discovered that actually. Did you see it? I saw her for a second. Okay, so she's in there, right? What's in this one? Ah, oh, I just... Oh, it doesn't. It doesn't let you. No! Because you do come out of this one, I think. Right? When you're running away from her. But yeah, it's just not happy. Oh! Oh! <laughs> and there it is, the music box with the eye on it. Hi, Six. So the reason that I think Six has turned into this creature is because the signal tower or at least the creature inside the signal tower wants to make um, the signal man, or the thin man, sorry. So it turns Six technically into the thin lady. Um, but because, like, I think there's something in the in the pictures because we see a kid who sat on a chair and I think that's Mono. So something to do with him is sat on a chair waiting. But when we first see Six, she's crouched around this so that when she becomes the thin lady, she, instead of, you know, because he's just sat, so he just becomes thin and long. Whereas she's sat around that, so she becomes contorted and stuff as things start moving. Um, we've got a picture of Six, what could be eating something? I thought it was a face, but no, that's the back of Six. Then we've got a picture of of the girl with the, the head scratched out. And then that. And of course, the dolls from the lady's residence. Hi, yeah. Are you, oh, did you just protect it? Oh, you did? Okay. Interesting, interesting. Oh, that's so sad. <laughs> the two bunnies sat together. It's so placed there in the light. Okay. Come on. Come on. You can do it. You're going to place it in front of me? Thank you. Wow. So good. 
Now, another theory as to what might be going on here that I've thought. Can I actually see? Oh, oh don't push me. You buggy. Another theory that I thought, right, is that Six knows what this monster is. Because think about it. When she was pulled into the room, um, I think once the signal man was killed, the thin man was killed, that's when the monster took control of her. So she would have seen these eyes. And could it be possible that... And I mentioned this in my stream. If you've missed my stream, I'll just mention it again. Also, these pictures are blank now. They used to have things in them, but they, they don't have anything. And I think... Maybe that's a deliberate choice of uh, Tarsi Studios or Little Nightmares, you know, retconning those pictures. Because the character who was in these pictures was a, a very early character from Little Nightmares. Or sorry, from Tarsi Studios. And I think maybe they still want to use that character, but not have it in Little Nightmares. So that's why they've retconned this suitcase to show that it's actually not there. I think that's what they've done. Um, but is it possible that Six has captured this creature, the eye creature, in here? So, in Mono's eyes, he's freeing Six, but doesn't know by freeing Six, he's actually freeing the monster. Are you right? Oh, no. I'm sorry! I'm sorry! Oh, God. I don't know if I'll be able to do it in first person, but we'll give it a shot. Hey, yeah! Well, ain't this terrifying? Wait, the wallpaper is different. Hold on. I don't care if I die here. Because I want to have a look at that wallpaper. That that wallpaper completely changed. Did you see that? Whoop. Oh, never mind. I guess I'll survive. Go on, crouch. Crouch. Whoop. Did she... Did she see me? I don't think she saw me. Okay. I was really slow there. The wallpaper changed. The wallpaper had eyes on it. Off you go, go on. Off you go. Oh, what? Oh, whoa! Whoa, weird glitches. Oh, there's me. Okay. Oh, it's in look at that. That's the first time that we've seen a hole like that appear. And there's another picture of the face. Okay, off we go. And then here it is. Breaking back in to Six's uh, area. Now this... Oh! Six is hidden behind this door. And there's the music box. I think they're just holding that there just for the time being. But that's interesting that... I don't think we're supposed to see that. And again, breaking through this door. And... Hurry up! I was behind you a second ago, Six! Uh, okay, I'll take the axe. So we want to call and then run through. So... Oh, God. I think I'm dead. Yeah, I'm not surprised. I got—I don't know what happened there. I got stuck. <laughs> oh, it's weird controls in here. Oh. Okay, it's weird controls. I think I'm just going to have to die for a second. Sorry. Whoa! <laughs> what a... I would love to have seen what that looked like. I would have got booed across the stage. <laughs> oh, we don't see that. Look at that. We don't see it, but in first person, we do. Now, is it possible that the eyes are making these doors appear, bringing Mono to Six deliberately? Because they want to be freed? Hey, look, the more it gets hit, the more that it, uh, the more that it actually does seem to appear. Like the, uh, the bodies of the eye and stuff. Okay, so we're gonna... Oh, okay, okay, so we need to go this way. Oh, God, she almost got me there. <laughs> We probably could, yeah, I think, just be able to do it. Oh, damn it! <sighs> she was so quick. Oh, my God. Okay, we're going to do it. 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 Ah! Oh, yes! <laughs> that was close. I forgot what was... <laughs> I forgot what hit was. <laughs> Go run! Run, you fool! Woo! That was close. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go! Ah! Oh no! That's it! 
That's it. I think we're, think we're here. We're here. We're at the end now. Oh, that's freaky. We're not supposed to see that. I don't think. And she just takes it. Are we still... There we go. We're up now. The I was weird that the eyes are there. I mean, if we go first person, we're, we're not supposed to see these eyes. But first person we do. The monster's in there. I know I'm so sorry. Yo. I'm so sorry. But am I though? Am I really sorry? Oh no, I was gonna say, hold the phone the whole time. Can I just get out that way? But no, look at her. Just desperate to get back. Can we look inside? Like, is there anything actually inside it? No. But it's like a spell. It's a spell that's keeping her here that we need to break. And there she is. Where are we? Where there? And it starts crumbling down. Look at her. She's like, you did what? You broke it. <laughs> no, she could be mad at me there. Because I've, I've released this creature and she actually kept it safe. Oh, go. Time to go. Time to go. Go, 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 go. Oh God! Actually, you know what? Sod it. I want. I want to try and just see if I can do it. Okay, come on, go, 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 get go with the go, go. Yep, yep. Sod it. Sod it. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do this in first person. Six, don't you leave me! Don't leave me! Look, at this. she's not looking back. Did I just die? It's like, it's like the game just didn't want me to go that way there. It was like, no, you're not following Six. So obviously the game is designed in a way where Six will always be in front of me. So, whoop, I'm doing really well here. But keep jumping. You jump faster than you run. Yeah, this is the bit where I just need to wait. Yeah, I needed to wait there. Which makes Six just... Oh God, there's eyes underneath. Oh, it's T posing six! Up. Come on! No, oh, you bugger you! Yep! Oh, six! Wait! No! You're gonna save me this time. We've been through so much together. No, oh, it's so sad. She turns back now. Come on! Up. Oh no, I can't see it properly. I can see her. I mean, when I fall, I'll be able to see her. No. Oh, wait, what? No! No! No, are you just gonna see me fall? No! Oh my god, he goes and goes. Whoa! Whoa! The camera just like. camera just blew up. It was like boing straight out. Is that because I vanished? Because I think we played the whole time and Mono's model like never vanishes, but maybe it... it... Oh. oh, that was weird. And here we are at the mercy of this eye creature. So I have tried to run away from it, but it doesn't matter. How far away you run from it, it you always come back to the chair. Now, there's no there's no wall we can run into. We can't hit the side of the signal tower. We're just trapped inside it now. It's like at this point it's decided. It's like ah, I know your, I know your nightmare. I know what you don't want to see. Don't look at me. Don't do it. <laughs> Fine, I'll sit in the chair. Happy, the throne of sludge. Oh God! Oh God! Oh! Oh! Oh no! First person of what Mono sees. Oh no! Yeah, I don't like the look of this. This ain't too great. No, this is this is pretty nightmarish. Whoop! And then they're inside his head. 
And that's it. They got him. Does this change? Hey, look, this that's untextured stuff. This is when I decide to sit. I'll wait. No. Oh. A mono just has to, for him, wait years and years wondering what he did wrong. Oh, oh, there's no camera. There's no first person camera because Mono's model is gone. Yeah, if I go first person, there's nothing there. I wonder if I, when the Thin Man appears, if I can take first person of him. Oh, does that mean that Mono isn't actually the Thin Man? He just gets turned into a Thin Man. I was kind of hoping that when we, we jumped and grabbed Six's hand, that we'd be looking up at her. But the way that the, the mod is... Obviously, you're like, you have to be above the head. Otherwise, you know, you're just going to co see constant clipping of hair and stuff. Can we do anything? Nah. It's interesting. They, this tile texture is, I think, just un, uh, untextured, just mesh. <laughs> but they were like, ah, it looks, it works. Just keep it in. <laughs> and also, maybe that kind of fits into, yeah. Maybe that just fits into the Thin Man in a way. And his room that it is just sort of unfinished, untextured. So when when Six was in the signal tower, she made a maze. Like, to try and find her, you couldn't really get to her. But when Mono is the thin man and he's in the signal tower, it's a straight... As soon as you get in, you can open that door and release him. He wants to be released. Six didn't. Six tried to hide herself away. Is that because she knew what she captured inside that music box that this monster was trapped there? Ah, so many theories, man. I've got an interesting one. Uh, I haven't written anything out for it, but it concerns the world of Little Nightmares. Oh, do we get to see this in first person? No way. Dude. Oh yeah, that's like a guest mask. That's nice. There's six. Oh, that's interesting. We don't even hear the thing. We can't move or anything. Oh, wow. There she is. So the reason why I don't think we heard Six's hunger until she leaves the TV is because that's when she's like back in reality. Oh, we don't hear it. It's only in this camera, the, the hunger. Well, 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 there it was. The fourth playthrough I've done of freaking Little Nightmares. <laughs> done it one for the playthrough, the, 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 obviously the channel. We did now, well, then I did one for the PS4. Then I did this one, which was the first person. And I've done it before for a live stream. So it's four times now I've played through Little Nightmares completely. Oh my God. In first person, I wouldn't say it was better because it's obviously not the way it's supposed to be played. Yeah, it's it's definitely not meant to be played this way, but in first person, there's just so much more you see um, and it just immerses you. If, if you could not have the right side as a big empty space and it was all rendered, which is very rare um, because obviously the camera needs to see what's going on. If that... Oh, that would be so good. Like a VR experience in Little Nightmares universe. I think now, before I make my next theory video, I really just want to explore uh, the comic books as well. Um, well, not the comic books. Because we've already done that. But I mean like the, the sort of ones you get on your app uh, with the kids, other kids concerned inside this universe. I feel like there'll definitely be a DLC. They made it for the first one because I think it was... Little Nightmares was popular, but it wasn't as popular as Little Nightmares 2. Little Nightmares 2, everybody and their bloody mams was playing it. It was like every streamer, I think, played Little Nightmares 2. Uh, Little Nightmares 1 was kind of this cult game. Um, and they felt like... it. I feel like the DLC was just, you know, well... If we, if we make a sequel, then it's going to take years and we might lose this steam. But if, if we make a... You know, we make DLC... We can release it in increments and it'll keep people interested. Thank you so much for making an amazing game that 
just by looking at Little Nightmares 2 captivated so many people and I hope that when, you know Bandai are now taking control of it and I'm sure they will not let this go to waste they'll definitely make more games and I hope that when they do it'll be just as good and if they do need any guidance then they can contact you know the the creators one of the creators has said or producer said that they just want to make a world um and that was pretty much what little nightmares was it didn't need answers it was just this world that they made and it felt interesting and you wanted to know more there maybe wasn't answers ready or even there would ever be any kind of answer uh, that could be made in a, a way that we could you know like a, it would make sense i mean but whoever you know came up with little nightmares i'm just so glad that got to the stage that it got to bandai picked it up and were able to help fund it to be made and then obviously with the success of that the dlc um the amount of fan art and animations and creations that are online are so good and I, I just feel like I'm glad that I I can share my enjoyment of this game with other people. And I just want to thank uh, Tossy Studios for making this game and giving everybody this experience that they could they could share in. Like when I went to Gamescom, I had no idea Little Nightmares Two was going to be there, and apparently they they premiered something there. Um, like they announced the trailer and stuff. And when I went down to one of the halls and I turned a corner and I saw. Little Nightmares 2, like, in big print, and this stage they set up with the Huntsman and Night like, Six and Mono running around. I was like, no way. This is so cool. Because it was like that with EGX, when I first went to EGX, I didn't expect there to, like, this Little Nightmares, was like, oh, this looks cool. And I played it, and I was like, whoa, this is awesome. And then spoke to one of the uh, creators, um, not knowing that... Little Nightmares 1 was going to be so big and 2 was going to be something that I was going to cover, the cover in the channel, especially when, you know, I just, it was out of my comfort zone for what my channel was. It was dinosaur content and that seemed to be the big thing. And you go off, you diverge too much from what is expected of you and your audience might not be there. Well done. Well done. And I think this will be the last time I play Little Nightmares 2 campaign on my channel unless something big comes out uh if of course anything comes out we'll play it any dlcs any wait a minute sorry i was i was just logging out and sorry turning things off and i clicked a button i was just like clicking buttons on my xbox controller and this happened and i mean because of the the mod we got on we can go first person oh that's got to be like a least drag oh that's so cool did i just restart from my last checkpoint I think that's what I did. I restarted from my last checkpoint during the credits. That's why it was just there. <laughs> and now, now the chair's there. Oh, that is so weird. So that explains why I'm here. Oh, oh God. But I think the next Little Nightmares thing you can see will be a theory, but it's not on my top uh, to-do lists uh, at the moment. Um, and I just kind of want to get back into normal rhythm and stuff. But anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. And until next time, I'll see you cuties later. Bye-bye. <laughs>